Hey year three, welcome back to another maths lesson with Miss Monaghan. Um, so today we're going to be starting or revising our final measurement unit um, that we did in school, all to do with volume. Now can you remember, you might be able to tell just by looking at the guided practice, what do we measure volume in? So volume is measured in millilitres and litres. So today we're just going to be using milliliters. So this look at guided practice. The beaker, so that's this thing, contains coloured water. What is the volume of water in each beaker? So in A, we can see it looks a bit tricky. Do you think we should read this top line or this bottom line here? Now be careful because it's 3D, it looks like we might be able to read that one, but we're going to read the bottom one that's just the back of the beaker it's a little bit easier when we, we used our measuring jugs in real life you might have some measuring jugs in the house um or some measuring spoons even you could go see the volume of them so let's have a look this is our unit here for milliliters ml so 100 milliliters where does the red liquid go up to can you see can you read that there so the red liquid fills up to the 50 so the volume of the coloured water in the beaker is about 50 millilitres now in this one it's still the same measurement so it's still in millilitres and we're going to look 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 so it fills up to about 70 millilitres now our final one, really, really short, to get a practice today. The volume of coloured water in the beaker is about, so let's see, 10, 20 millilitres. Now I've asked you today to do two workbook pages, um, just because, look, you've seen how fast they are, super duper speedy. If you've got time, you can do a challenge at the end as well. Okay, but come back tomorrow, and we're going to do some more measuring volume. Bye guys.